back. SpaceX is working to bring low-cost internet to people around the world with their Starlink satellites. Right now, it has about 150,000 users, and it's slowly but surely gaining some traction. But if SpaceX can't attract people, the internet service has proven it can attract cats. What? Yeah, cats. <laughs> the satellite internet service recently grabbed headlines when these oh photos gosh. went viral. It shows cats and birds snuggling up on satellite dishes, Alex. <laughs> I love it. Joining us today is Aaron Taylor, who took these adorable viral photos. Oh, and there's a cat and right there's there. a cat. <laughs> is your cat one of those that was on the satellite? <laughs> No, this one, uh, this one gets extra special privileges. He spends more time in the house. <laughs> Got it. So if anything happens to your internet connection, then we know why. Why are your cats so attracted to these satellite dishes? Well, uh, basically the, the snow melt mode on the Starlink dish uh, has a heater in it to keep the snow <laughs> off. And I got it sitting on the south side of my house. Sunny days, the cats just want to go have a sun bath. It's smart. So what impacts your service more, the snow or the cats? <laughs> uh, definitely the cat. The snow, uh, we had a snowstorm go through here last night. Power was out most of the night, but uh, we had no down service once the power was on. If the melt mode comes on, the cats, uh, yeah, they'll, they'll stop your streaming in the middle of the afternoon if you were if you're in the house. <laughs> that is so funny. I, that's like one thing that I never plan on ever saying is like, oh, got to get the cats off the dish. <laughs> but going yeah. viral with 200,000 likes, did Starlink reach out to you? And what has their response been? Uh, no, Starlink hasn't reached out. Uh, the response from my notifications on my phone has been <laughs> a little bit unreal. Uh, I used I had one like one time that had 50. Wow. Uh, <laughs> Uh, but this one, uh, yeah, it's been, yeah, lots of, lots of likes, lots of comments of, uh, oh, they're cute. Uh, also the comments of, oh, why don't you have a hot house for them? Well, they have that. Oh, uh, well, yeah, of course. <laughs> How many cats do you yeah. have? And, and do dogs dig the dish? Uh, no, nope. uh, none of the other animals bother the dish. Uh, we have... Uh, we have sheep and goats and pigs here uh, and then the big livestock guardian dogs. Uh, none of them bother it. Uh, most aren't allowed near it. Um, but cat-wise, uh, there's probably 25 around here in the that run around on the farm. Uh, some are tame and some are just uh, feral. That is a lot of cats and not a lot of dish for them to all share. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Very cool. Aaron Taylor, owner of Spectrum Grain Solutions. Appreciate you joining us this morning. Very cool photos. Happy to be here. <laughs> Fun story. See ya.